Hi, it's The Magic of Math here, and today we're talking about fractions as division problems. Here we go. So we're going to start with a little review. We have two-thirds. This is a fraction. When we talk about this fraction, this vinculum, this fraction bar, is talking about a whole that has had three total parts. So we're going to take a whole of something. I'm using a circle, but it could be a rectangle or a square. It could be a cookie, a cake, anything you want it to be. And we're going to divide it into three equal parts. So the denominator tells you of your whole how many parts you're going to have. And then our numerator talks about our quote unquote shaded parts or the desired amount of the whole. So when we have two thirds, that means we're going to shade in two of those three equal parts. So this is two thirds of our whole. When we talk about that, we could also write two thirds as two divided by three. We want two of the three sections. So we've had a whole that's been divided into three sections and we want two of those three parts. So two thirds is the same mathematically as two divided by three. Now let's see if you can apply this. I'm gonna ask you this question. Which of the following expressions is equivalent to five times one half? So we have our product five multiplied by one half and four answer choices. I would like you to pause the video now, make an answer choice and come back to check your work. Welcome back. So again, let's review. We're looking for the equivalent expression from our four answer choices to five multiplied by one half. So let's understand one half written mathematically. Again, we're going to have our whole, which our denominator is two. So we're going to have two parts. So our whole divided into two parts. And we want to talk about one of those two parts. So now when we do that, we have our one of our whole divided into two sections. So one half is one divided by two. Now we want to bring down the first part of our expression, which was five multiplied by that value one half or one divided by two. So five multiplied by one divided by two is equivalent to five times one half. When we look at our answer choices, we see that that is answer choice A. So I thank you for joining me as we talk about fractions written as a division statement. That's the magic of math, where we continue to master math one video at a time. I hope you'll come back soon and have a great day.